Hey everybody, welcome to Day on the Deck. All my YouTubers and Wolfpack, how you going? <laughs> Not too bad of a day today. Looks like it might be a nice day. Uh, so, first week of training going pretty good. Uh, this is the third day, middle of my uh, training week. So far, so good. Um, really, no complaints, so... Everything seems to be working fine and going good so far, so it can only improve. So that's what we're trying to do, is trying to improve. Uh, so anyway, the first uh, first official week of my uh, big country throwdown that I'm going to is uh, doing all right. So I'm quite happy with that. Yeah, so I got lots of, lots of stuff to do today. One thing I gotta do is get an old uh, sewing tape measure, you know, the cloth kind. Gotta measure three places around my elbow and my knee, and I gotta measure my waist so I can get new knee pads, elbow pads, and a belt. Because I need that for uh, training and for the event itself. Well, not think I'm gonna go with Bells of Steel. They're a company here in Canada. And they're right here in Ontario, so that's a good thing. Um, but I think I'll go with them, and hopefully because I'm buying three things, they're going to give me a deal on it. But if I'm not mistaken, each item is like 50 bucks. So if I'm not mistaken, it's $150. I'm going to try to get a deal on it, you know, because I want it to be cheaper. So <laughs> we'll see what happens. Uh, the straps I got are fine, um, nothing wrong with them, uh, they're from Riptide, um, but they're fairly decent straps, so far anyway, you know, they haven't been bad, so, and, uh, yeah, I got a, <laughs> I got a couple of strange, uh, strange, uh, messages on the, uh, Messenger, you know, on my Facebook. Um, <laughs> and that was cute. Anyway, uh, three or four people typed because I was talking about strong man training and stuff uh, the other day. And they're like, really, really? You're going to do that? You're going you're gonna to train until you're 75? I'm like, yeah, why not? You know? Um, but anyway, so yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to... I'll tell you again, just, you know, because that was funny. But, yeah, no, uh, I'm going to train for about another 10 years, so I'll be about 75. Um, by the time, you know, that happens. So, um, yeah, that's what I'm looking, trying to do, is I want to keep training strong, man. Uh, going to continue until, until I'm 75 anyway. After that, I might slow down. Might decide, ah, uh, you know, this is getting to be too much. But, you know, I'm never, uh, probably never going to be uh, Superman or anything like that. But, you know, as long as I'm improving or staying the same, like once I get a little higher, you know, if I'm staying the same, why not keep training, you know? For one thing, I like it. It's fun. Uh, for another thing, it keeps me out of trouble. Because I can get in trouble real quick, you know. So, <laughs> so yeah, I, that's what I'm thinking anyway. So I'm going to train until I'm 75, and we'll go from there. Uh, but for sure, you know, as uh, long as I don't get struck down, you know. Um, yeah, why not? We're going to go until we're 75. That's what we're going to do. And, uh... In the back of my mind, I'm hopefully still competing on the 70s and over class, you know. Uh, they haven't even invented yet. So, I'm going to be a pioneer for the 70s and over class. How's that? <laughs> uh, but, yeah, so. I don't know. It just seems like something to do. So, that's what we're going to try to do anyway. Just keep going, you know. Um... Yeah. So today is squats. So, like I said, I'm really busy 
busy over at Ma's because you know mom you know I'm I'm very very happy because mom's still here uh, but she needs a lot of help and stuff throughout the day so my training is kind of suffering a little bit right like getting all my means done but not really doing a lot of accessories but it's the first week so not that big of a deal anyway another nine days or eight days before they back then they're home for four days and they're going for another two weeks so then after that they're not going anymore that's it for this year so I shouldn't have any more trouble after that with my training so if I can keep doing every day doing my mains uh, my main stuff and slip in accessories once in a while if I can do that then maybe we'll be all right so but then after that I can really dedicate back to you know my full-time training so but you don't get anywhere if you don't try simple as <laughs> Uh, but I will admit, you know, I'm getting more and more excited about uh, a big, a big country showdown, or throwdown. Sorry, big country throwdown. Getting more and more excited about it. Looking forward to it. Nervous about it still because my numbers are way, 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 way too low. <laughs> but I got lots of time, so I'm um, not gonna stress about it. Hopefully uh, by then, which is like 17 weeks or so, 16 weeks, hopefully by then, you know, with all the dedication and the hard yards and everything else, I'll bring my numbers up quite a bit, but um, we're going to do our best anyway. That's all we can do, right? Uh, control the controllables and let the other shit take care of itself. That's all we can do, right? That's, that's my motto. It's always been my motto. So I guess that's enough gabbergating for today. Uh, anything else happens today, I'll let you know. But yeah, so that's about it. Uh, just uh, do your best to be your best, and we'll talk to you later. Bye.